everyone, I'm Sarah from Pixel Sift, and today I'm talking to Mike from Digital Load, who are here with their game Aspire One. So can you tell us a little bit about the game? Yeah, sure. It's a, a stealth action shooter, so we're inspired by games like Metal Gear, GoldenEye, Splinter Cell. Try and imagine those games. How could you bring those mechanics to VR? Is this the very first demo that you brought to PAX Australia? It is, it's, and for many of us on the team, it's our first game uh, in terms of development and our first PAX as well. So. First time showing it to the public, we've, we've been lucky to get it to E3 and Gamescom this year, but they've been private kind of um, press booths, so it's been, it's, it's mental. The game looks really stunning at the moment. How long has it been in development for? It, uh, it started late 2016, but it was a solo effort until about early 2018. Film Victoria gave us some funding. It ended up to Tripwire and Oculus um, helping us, and now we're published by Tripwire with a team of eight people. So. The core development's been since 2016, but a year and a half of full development. What's it been like developing a VR game as the very first game on the, of the very first VR game for most of your team? Uh, it's been a nightmare, but um, yeah, I think half the challenge too has been we're, we're trying to um, get the game to run on Oculus Quest, the kind of standalone uh, mobile phone based kind of uh, virtual reality headset all the way up to PC. And so there's been lots of challenges, technical design along the way, but it's been a, it's like a fun nightmare. So where can people find the game online if they want to know more about it? Um, we've got a website, aspire1.com. Um, we're not great web designers though, so if you look at, check us out on Discord, we're on there every day, Facebook and Twitter, and um, say hello. Brilliant. Go check it out.